Holy smoke. This place is completely different. That's what I love about the beach, man. It changes so often. This place is like I've never seen before. Today, uh, we do have the Equinox and the Trunk, but we're gonna try out the Apex first. So we're at pretty much our favorite local beach down here. It's a beautiful day here in Florida. Try not to break my ankles walking through these rocks. So we're probably gonna head to the soft sand, considering I am not gonna be able to dig through these rocks, but we're gonna give it our best go to find some goodies out here. We got about three or four hours to hunt. So stick around everybody, see what we can come up with, eh? All right, everybody. After swinging for probably only about a minute, got our first target. It's reading a 67 through 70. Let's see if we can get him out with the old apex, shall we? Haven't been given the old Garrett Ace Apex the love it deserves. <laughs> I mean, especially out at the beach. I think that we all know by now, I think the Apex's strong point is out at the beach. For me at least, I struggle with it out at the park, but I haven't really given it a fair chance to shine at the beach. So that's what we're gonna do today, man. And if I still do not like it, if I don't like the feel of it overall, we're gonna fund that new Nocta with this Garrett Ace Apex, so. It's out of the hole, man. It's reading up higher now, though. 70, 75. Got our old Garrett Carrot with us, too. See what we got, everybody. First target of the day, man. There it is. It is a piece of... I think it's a piece of can shrapnel. Yes, it's a piece to a can. So starting it off, eh, not the best, but I guess not the worst either. It's not iron, but it is some piece of can. So awesome. let's keep on swinging everybody. I'll catch you guys at the next target, or maybe I'll just bring you along live for a minute. See if we can hit another target within a quick minute. Always cover your holes, eh? That was it. So let's do it. Let's see if we can come up with anything today, guys. I'm hopeful, but you know, it's no guarantee. You just gotta give it your best shot out there. Getting a VDI on this one, or I'm not really getting a VDI, but I'm getting a constant tone. So I think there's something under there. We're gonna go for it. Pretty sure it's gonna be deeper if it's gonna be anything. Let's check it out, man. See if the apex is squeaking out something on us. We also have the CKG scoop with us. Big shout out to the guys over at CKG. They actually sent me over this thing for free to test. But uh, it's a really good price on it. Like I bought one before I had this off of Amazon. I think I paid like 80 bucks for it for just the scoop part. So uh, this one comes with the scoop and the carbon fiber handle. It's a good price for a beginner scoop. Eventually I might wanna get one of those uh, more expensive ones. I think it's the extreme scoop, but we make do with what we've got for now, right? I'm glad we even have a sand scoop. I'm thankful for this bad boy. Huh. I think there's something in there. I'm gonna keep chasing it. It's still giving me a tone. Might just be a deep one, man. Big old rocks down in there don't make it easy. It's out. So it was, the apex hit something pretty deep there, man. 78, 79. I'm gonna guess it's gonna be a coin. Let's check it out. That's not too shabby though, that thing was deep. 
you got to give the apex credit where credit's due. Holy eating away, Penny. <laughs> That's an absolute corroded. I think it's a 1960s penny, 1961 copper penny, but it's eaten away to almost nothing. So that's a good sign to me, man. Let's keep on swinging, everybody. I think today's gonna be a good day. Fill in our hole, always, and get on to the next one. Kind of bouncy one in between these rocks. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get it, but we're gonna try, man. This is the beach that I found. I found three gold rings in one day at this beach, so that's my my best day ever. We're gonna try to match that, man. <laughs> now we keep our uh, we keep our expectations realistic. It would be nice to find uh, another ring of some kind out here today, but we're gonna do our best. 65, 66, right about here. See what we're working with. Is it gonna be a stinker zinker? Oh, nope, it's a fishing weight. That's not too bad. We're on the heavies right here, I guess. At least one, so let's keep hunting around here. See what else we can come out with. Apex, not too shabby, man, not too shabby. Here, I want to show you a little bit of a hack I did too with the Apex. Right here on the back where the speaker is, I slapped a piece of vinyl tape over it to uh, kind of muffle the volume because for me, the Apex is really, really loud. So that makes it almost perfect. So let's keep on swinging everybody. Put that rock back in there. Give you a quick look at where we're at. It's beautiful out here, huh? Don't get much better than this, man. Hope you guys enjoy. Hey, if you're new here, consider sticking around, huh? We're gonna have some more beach detecting action for you. So, I love the beach, man. It's gotta be one of my favorite places to hunt. So one thing I wonder is if I'm missing stuff with the Apex that the Equinox would have hit. Cause already I got another one of those really faint signals down there. Let me try to pump it up to maximum sensitivity, see if it can handle it. Seems to be kind of stable. Kind of stable. Definitely got another one down in there, but it's gonna be another deep one, man. One downfall about this scoop is it's a little too small for me. I would have preferred if it was slightly bigger, but Hey man, we like I said, we work with what we got. We can't complain. I'm glad to have a scoop regardless. Let's see. Still in there? Scoop it. I should have had you bring that bigger scoop. Oh, is that it? That was probably the ball it was on, I bet. The dirt ball. I literally just dug this entire crater and the target got away from me. I've wasted enough time on this one. Sometimes that's the way it goes. You don't want to spend too much time on the target, right? Fill it in, get on to the next one. Got us a really good sounding one right here. 63, 65. Didn't sound too deep. I think it's out. 65. Oh, there she is right there. First one of those, but it's an ancient one, huh? Nice and crusty, man. It's a pole tabber. Old palm tree.
just in this little clumpy clump. It's a coin. The water's too far out to even rinse it. Pretty sure it's just gonna be a penny. Probably a zinc penny. It's a black one though, man. Hello, how are you? Thank you very much. Yeah, I make make sure you got to do that, right? It looks clear in there. It's strange how that happened, though. I I don't I don't know if they maybe did that with their machine. A solid EU one in there. It's lower out of the hole now. Seventy seven, seventy eight. Just a coin, man. Another penny. It's a penny. You parked over there? Did you bring the big coil? Yeah, bro. Yeah, I am the stock coil. Okay, I was gonna say, because I know I had the baby coil on the ET. I'm not so sure how much. Bitties. There it is. It's a beaver tail, man. Hard to escape those when you're out at the beach. That's for sure. Oh, that ain't what I'm looking for. <laughs> but we gonna take it, I guess, huh? <laughs> Sounded good. It's an ultra bouncy one. Just met a really nice guy out here. He was swinging a Quest detector. I think he said it was a Quest Key 60. I've heard pretty good stuff about the Quest machine, so. Hey man, I always wish the other guys luck out here, you know? I like to put myself in their shoes, right? I'd want to find something out here. It's friendly competition. Apex seems like it's going pretty deep though. Targets I'm pulling aren't the greatest, but I sent Destiny to put the big coil, 15 inch coil on my Equinox and we're gonna bring the Equinox out here in a second. So a couple more with the Apex. Now, I don't know if I'm missing anything, but this is, this apex is going pretty, pretty deep, man. There it is. 
46 solid right under a ring wouldn't that be amazing it didn't sound good though in the hole so there it is <laughs> ain't quite a ring eh? piece to an old crusty rusty beaver tail man some yonk filling our hole get on to the next that was deep though so maybe i should stick with the apex i don't know it's a hard choice we'll swing the equinox here in a minute i've probably been swinging the apex for close to 45 minutes not too too many targets out here apex really ain't doing too bad though it's actually being very quiet considering something right on top here i think there it is it's a rare pull tab man the elusive red pull tab let's keep swinging the apex we'll give it a shot we got a little bit of a cut right here so sometimes i like hunting just before the cut drops off though too right out the big guns now big boy scoop the original scoop who remembers this bad boy the old faithful <laughs> pvc handle old crusty rusty all right let's do this so what are we going with oh the apex don't like the equinox huh she's screaming might have to change the channel Ooh, what's this? It's a bag. Something's in it. What is this? Yo, might have something. 